It was a well-attended social dance by family members, traditional rulers, clergymen, and politicians from far and near. <laughs> the late chief Echato was a core traditionalist, a great community development supporter, and a political leader. The children were also joined by relatives and other guests to the dance floor. <laughs> The children described their father as the best anyone could ever wish for. He was accessible to all and um, we would really miss him. He was always there for his kids. He was just the best father ever. He's a, a result-oriented man. He's a man of determination. Some well-wishers showered encomiums on the departed icon. He's one man that is full of smile and each time he called me, it's always when I am thinking of solution to certain events that is happening in the state. Definitely I will miss him and uh, I want to say to the children that they should, they should come up to cover the vacuum that the father have created. He was just a special breed. He's one of those people we admire at Ikobahi. He helped the development of Ikobahi. He was one man who added grace and color to every event. Well, he was somebody that was always there for people. They should try as much as possible to uh, sustain the legacy of their father. Guests were entertained with various delicacy and musical interlude. Also, a Thanksgiving service was held at New Covenant Gospel Church, followed with a posthumous birthday celebration of the deceased. The late Obasuge of Benin, Eduo Ekato, is survived by a wife, 11 children, and 15 grandchildren. He died at the age of 73. In Benin, Peter Oibo, NTA News.